We need to talk. A family conference. <laughs> I think everyone had their say back at the school, except me. I'm going to go to bed. No. I'm supposed to be flying to Scotland tonight, and I'm not leaving things like this. Well? Why didn't Jed say anything to me if he was so upset? He didn't want to seem ungrateful, Mum. Well, what brought all this on? That old lady who died at the care home last night. Mrs Flynn! The whole thing reminded Jed of his nan. She was the only family he had. He made him stay somewhere that brought back his worst memories. I'm sorry, I, I, I didn't think. No, Mum, you didn't! Jed is the only person that's tried to help me, and now he needs our support and we're not even giving it! He's not family, Maddie. There are limits. Dad said it was fine, and then you said no for absolutely no reason! Can you back me up here? Um, Maddie... You can be so f selfish! No wonder Rob went travelling! No wonder Dad cheated on you! Maddie! And if you're not careful, you're gonna lose me as well! Hey! Do not walk out! I'll move back in tonight. Separate beds, if you like, but Maddie needs stability. Oh, just go. My flight's in three hours. I'd have to leave right now. You want me to get on a plane? With all this going on, abdicate all responsibility? Well, shame you didn't think about that when you were Wendy. If Jed was to move in, temporarily, could I trust you to be sensible? Of course you could. You'd have to sleep in Rob's room. Rob's room? You sure? Perhaps we all need to be brave. Move forward. <laughs> 